Leadership isn't about the destination. It's a process and it takes years to develop. It's not really about being seen as the person in charge or dressing a certain way or even being the final decision maker. It's about learning how to communicate in a way that builds trust. Here are four small ways you can start doing that right now. Effective leadership isn't about singing people's praises all day long. Studies have shown that it's negative feedback when communicated appropriately that actually is the most helpful to people. People want to learn and feel challenged to be better today than they were yesterday. Finding ways to facilitate that growth by giving constructive feedback is a crucial soft skill. The sandwich method is popular, where you give constructive feedback in between positive feedback. But so is just having regular, honest conversations that end with actionable steps forward. In leadership positions, it can be easy to fall into a mentality of being the victim. Instead, it's important for you to be the one to take accountability first. No matter what happens, it's important for you to take a moment to question the role you played. Maybe you've been more absent than normal, or maybe you've been tending to other issues. Whatever it is, great leaders lead by example and own what they brought to the table before criticizing others. Micromanaging people is rarely effective. Obviously, you want to put guardrails in place, but your goal is to get them to a point where they feel comfortable and confident operating on their own. That's how you get someone to move from being just an employee to a real team member. This can take a lot of patience on your part, but their long-term knowledge and independence makes it worth it. Employees should feel comfortable giving their managers and leaders direct feedback. The only way to create an effective feedback loop is to foster an environment where an employee telling their boss how they feel is well received and appreciated. The last thing you want is to work in a vacuum of your own thoughts. You have much more to gain by hearing other people's perspectives than you have to lose.